The dangerously frigid temperatures have folks creating even more danger for themselves trying to keep warm. Two other house fires in the past couple of days, and in both homes, there was a space heater involved. Nine on your side's Tony Moronis tells us what you need to know to keep yourself safe if you're using space heaters. Keeping warm is important, especially when you're trying to relax at home. Some of us use space heaters, you know, out of convenience. But if we're not careful, our house could catch fire. Leave us out in the cold. This is the worst case scenario. A St. Bernard home went up in flames last night. It started with the space heater and this boathouse on the Ohio River from the same thing Sunday night. And you want to make sure it's always in repair, it's not damaged. I'll give you a perfect example. This cord, if it's frayed, torn, or whatever, it can easily cause a spark and cause a fire. Only plug the device directly into the wall and make sure it's secured all the way in. Using extension cords, any kind of permanent wiring can lead to a safety hazard. But if you did use it, make sure the wire is wider than the heater's wire. Remember the two fires I told you about? Both of those were caused by space heaters. They were too close to other materials. People, people get cold and they'll want this thing real close to them, especially a small one like this. And it could wind up in bed with a person. That's why, yeah, I'm going to say that. Don't do it because it's, a, you know, sometimes people, if they don't know, they don't know. So keep combustibles away. Keep your children away. This shouldn't be on when you're away from the house. This shouldn't be on when you're asleep, according to your manufacturer. These rules are the same for kerosene heaters. If you're using those, make sure you have working carbon monoxide detectors inside. In addition to, always, always make sure your smoke detectors are working properly. Tony Moronis, 9 on your side.